Hi y'all, it's Dr. Law here with the segment of what to do during a quarantine to keep yourself from dying from a deadly virus. This segment's gonna be how to wax your wife's legs. So your wife, who likes to look pretty for y'all, will take some extra time and shave all the time. Well, we're gonna do some waxing today cause she can't go to the salon and get those legs waxed like she normally would. So what we're using today is a great product from Sally Hansen. First thing you gotta do is uh, heat your wax up. It says 30 minutes in the microwave. Um, uh, sorry, correction, 30 seconds. Uh, Y'all put it in the microwave for 30 minutes, you might have some pretty hard wax, you know what I'm talking about, you know? So anyhow, put it in for 30 seconds. But what we did, whoops. Well, that's okay. It's a little early, it's not ready yet. Um, so there's lots of uh, YouTube fails out there of people putting this on their bodies and getting burns. This is a good way to test to make sure your wax isn't too hot. We put it on your wife. You want your wife to be hot, but not like that. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, so okay. You get to the hair on the leg of my wife's hairs. They just grow all crazy. So picking a direction is gonna be tough for her, but you just gotta put a, take a little of this babe powder. Pop, 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 a little bit on there like that. I'm just gonna rub it on, rub it on real nice here. Just get a little, uh... Hey, what are them children doing downstairs? You tell them to get back. All right, so anyhow. Okay, so like I was saying, <clears throat> got the perfect consistency of this here wax. This one's a sticky wax. I think we're gonna start, we're gonna start right here on the front. Well, maybe. So one of the uh, YouTube videos I watched to get certified on doing this was uh, to divide the legs into segments, um, which, you know, you'd think for a doctor be easy to divide the leg into segments, but uh, I'm struggling a little. All right, so we're gonna put some of the wax on. So you put the wax on with the grain if you're a woodworker or with the growth of the hair if you're a beautician. I'm neither. So uh, I'm just gonna slap some of that on there uh, the best way I can, uh, just a little bit. Now you want to make sure when you put this on, it's just a very, very thin amount of wax that you're gonna put on this leg here. You should be able to see the hair through the wax. The, the strips are gonna come nice and long like this. So I've already got one piece that's cut pretty decent. Should be just about too small. There we go. Precision is everything. Okay, that's not true. Uh, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put this little, little piece on here like this. You gotta rub it, just rub it, rub it. Now, y'all with the dirty minds, you just keep keep minds out of the gutter. Get to rub the leg, get this thing on here nice and nice and tight, like warm it up. Yeah. All right. So we got it. So here's where it's important to remember which way the hair is growing, because you want to now go uh, against the way the hair went. So if you're like me and your memory is a little faulty, you're gonna be in trouble. I really don't remember which way it's going. That's what people want from their doctor. A faulty yeah, memory. A faulty memory. That's me. <laughs> I really? Think you I did. don't well, remember? You're spreading it that way, so you must want to read that it way. that way. Yeah, okay. All right, so um, now this is where it gets to, you get to have a little fun with your with your significant other as you go take this off. I mean, you can count to three and then go on three, or you can count to three and go on two. <laughs> or you just don't even count, you just get after it. So, um, all right, honey, are you ready? I'm ready. One. You're not gonna go on three, I know you. Two. I trust you. Two and a half. Could you just do it? Yeah. Thank you. There we go, now. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, that's how we'd like to do it, just like that. Right there, right there, right there. Is this enjoyable for you? Well, you know, sweetie, anything at any time I get to spend with you 
is enjoyable time. You know that. Even if it's inflicting pain upon me? Well, you know, with 11 children, there's been a bit of pain infliction going on in our marriage. You're not um, wrong. So, you know, I just don't even know. Go over that one. I'm just going to leave that one right there. All yeah, right. I think that would be best. <clears throat> Pretty self explanatory, I think. When you love somebody, sometimes y'all just stick together. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Here we go. All right, that one I think is good and stuck. All right, baby. Wait, 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 wait. Other way. See? It's easy to get a little confused in here. All right, so we're going to go on three. One. Liar. Two. Three. It. What? Broke. Just. Babe. Happened. No. Literally. <laughs> do you see? I'm wondering about this Sally Hansen lady. Is she for real? It ripped. It tore. This is faulty craftsmanship, y'all. Baby, what is? All right, here we okay. go. We're going to try again. Please we're, get we're this not off gonna my count. leg. There we go. Okay. There we go. That That's, was real stuck. Yeah, that was. We're in the middle of taping a video and you were not part of it. <laughs> really? I think that dad has lost his um, well, this is not untrue. That might have some truth to it. Yeah, but, and they're just gonna keep coming. Who knocked yeah. now? Uh, re remember that 11 children part we talked about? Are they all gonna come in? They they gonna, and somehow not a single Daniel? one of them, little children, little sweet peas, got my accent. I don't even know how that's possible. Well, I did, Daddy. You're so right. You're so right. I forgot about that. And now everyone, Did you stay and, now, focused? and now the world knows why you're my favorite. They all wondered, how can you have a favorite? Your dad, how can you say that? Well, you're the only one, bumpkin, who sounds like me. Thank you, Daddy. Go wash my hands. Which, by the way, y'all should be doing. Washing your hands every day. Like sure once what, a day. I'm not sure what <laughs> what y'all were doing before the COVID hit. Like not washing your hands. Now it's like vogue to wash your hands. Y'all, I was washing my hands several times a day before this all started. I'm a trendsetter. Kind of like this beauty up here. Should we wax your head? Honey. <laughs> There's where your basic understanding of anatomy and physiology really shows, okay? Because the amount of hair per square inch on your leg is significantly different than the hair per square inch on my head, okay? So just think about that for a second, how much effort and pain's involved with ripping out like a hundred hairs versus a thousand hairs. I think I could do it. I've seen the YouTube video, honey. Are you ready? No. Do it. That one worked. Woo! That Heck one worked yeah, really that good. one did. That one worked real good. Yeah, yep. boy. Look at that. Back no, again. no. Now we. <laughs> All right, y'all. I guess we're back again. Okay. And then after that, are we done? Like, that'll be it. Well, almost. We gotta finish her up with the oil. Some parts of the world they call it Earl. Not, not I around, don't think they call it Earl anywhere. Not around these parts. We call it oil. I don't even know how you say that. Oil. It's oil, baby. Oil. Just like oil. I don't know how else you would say oil. Come on now. My well, daddy you gotta remember she is from up north, so you know how they are. Boise. <laughs> South Dakota, born and bred, baby. It's quite a southern accent from someone from South. South Dakota, <laughs> duh. Baby, I just need to pay someone to do this for me. Hashtag social distancing, honey. I, you can't just go out and do this right now. I mean, when this is all over, I, I think I'm gonna make an appointment for this. Laser. Tomorrow. Okay, deal. Lord. Why'd you make my wife with only two legs? Stop it. All right. You ready for the fun part? Well, it's fun for one of us. 
Two of us. Rude. Here comes the fun part, honey. You ready? Ah. Yep, that worked. Wow, so is that. That's a little bit too satisfying. Yeah, I was wondering if you were enjoying Honey, we're gonna keep going on up the no. leg and. <laughs> no, we are not. We just keep waxing we... all the way up. Nope. All right. Nope, we're good. <laughs> That'd be a different kind of YouTube channel. No. Nope. We're a G rated YouTube family, okay, y'all? Okay, here we go. Do you want to go on three, or should I just go? Two, what you, you do you. One, two. <gasps> well, you kind of stopped in the middle. I'll try that again. <laughs> Didn't quite come off all the way. It's fine. All right. There we go. <clears throat> I feel like that one, it wasn't as successful. Well, the bottom two thirds was real successful. Does that look good? That came off. Slicker and snap! I tell you what. Yeah, he dumped part of it in the bathroom accidentally. It's all over our bathroom counter now, so. Away, X! Huh. No, oh. the oil. Huh. Ah. Honey, why you gotta be telling my secrets? Because somebody's gotta clean that up. Hmm. It's gonna be me. It's gonna be you. It's gonna be me. It's gonna be me. It's gonna be me. It's gonna be me. Me. I don't understand. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying. Do you know May. how many times I've explained that meme to you? The the meme? The meme. You're talking about the meme. Yep. It's gonna be me. It's gonna be me. Okay. It's gonna be May next time I need to shave, is that right? It's gonna be May. Okay. Now it's gonna be May or you're volunteering to shave my legs? Do you remember that time I shaved your legs? And then you agreed to shave my face? Yes, I don't, I can't I do think that. it was more terrifying on my face than it was on your legs, because... That's true. And you were using a safety razor. It's I'm still a, scary. I a really good flat razor, straight razor shave on my face and head. Still waiting for that. Well, Thanks a lot, Corona. Exactly. Learned a couple tips. So, things to take away from this. Pay a professional. <laughs> Number one, if you can't pay a professional, the uh, Sally Hansen kit seems adequate. There's a bit of learning. So, you know, go with the grain for the wax, against the grain. And maybe a little bit on the warmer side, but don't burn anybody, y'all. Just make sure it's not too hot before you slather this on. It's literally cosmetic made palm, y'all. If this gets too hot, gets on your skin, it will literally burn through the skin. You can't get it off. Yeah, I want to know if people want to see me wax you. Well, hold oh, on. all of a sudden it got hold not on. funny. Look, I'm out of it. Y'all want to see somebody wax my back? You all comment. And if we get enough comments of people that actually want to see all this get waxed. Wax you like a surfer, dude. Like, I'm, I'll just. I'm game. I'll, I'll do it. Sign me up. Put a big old slather of wax all over this ape-like no. body. All right. Comment below. Uh, jar of wax or uh, pre-wax strip. Or maybe we'll try the hard wax on me first. I don't know. Comment, we'll see what happens. Subscribe, or, comment, we'll see. And then like it, y'all, like it. Stay tuned for future episodes of Dr. Law's Stay at Home Adventures. Bye, y'all.